Hello, it's your boy David Off. So, Ma is a horror movie. My worst category of movies. I hate them. But to be fair, this one is doesn't involve ghosts or demons or paranormal or a flipping doll. Nothing like that. If I watch any of those things, I'm just like, nope, no Annabelle for me, no conjuring, no paranormal activity. I just, I hate those things. I hate those things. But this one, the antagonist is a woman. A crazy woman who's a, a bit of a psycho and that I can handle I can handle that like I, I can handle a human being being the villain of a horror movie rather than like a flippin' doll so this this I can tolerate there were some jump scares in this some serious jump scares that really scared me scared the crap out of me to be honest um, but yeah they really build this up like it starts really slow and lighter tone in a way and then you start to meet Ma and then there's a few jump scares here and there and it's sort of like build up to like the climax and it starts to get a lot more intense towards the middle of the movie and then the ending is just it's mental so um yeah it wasn't that bad it, it was all right it was all right you know um it was less scary than us that's for sure i watched us and that was that was interesting as well um i liked um, i liked parts of that for sure but that was crazy scary like i, I, I was trying to look away at times for us for Ma, i could just i could watch the whole thing they were jump scares but that's as bad as it gets, it's just a few jump scares here and there. And that was fine, but... Jeez, this woman in this movie is a damn psycho. What's her name? Octavia Spencer, the actress's name. She, she is the best part of this movie. What I mean by that is, obviously she's a creepy character, she's a psycho in this movie. Her character is not her, obviously, but... She plays that character so damn well. Like, it's so believable, the way she plays this crazy woman who invites teenagers into her basement to have parties with a creepy with creepy intentions and it's just crazy and there's a backstory to it as well she, she gets a backstory gets flashbacks to, sh to see like why she is so crazy and um, it doesn't humanize her but it does like show you why like why she does what she does um, but it's actually mental like it gets so messed up at the end as well like I, I can't I'm not gonna spoil it I'm not gonna spoil it but at the end it just gets it gets so messed up. I'm just like, oh, what is this? This just escalated to some weird and ridiculous places. Um, one thing though, it wasn't like a great movie to me because the ending I felt was like, I mean, it was creepy, but like the, the final climax for me was anticlimactic. Anticlimactic, to be honest. I understood it, but I kind of wanted more from it at the end. It just like, things just happened. And it ended, and I was like, oh, because that was, <laughs> someone next to me said, is that it? Like, seriously, like, um, I, I still enjoyed quite a bit of it, um, and it was interesting. It was definitely worth checking out. Even though I hate horror, it was definitely worth checking out for me, I think. Definitely worth it. I was going to see John Wick 3 instead. I was going to see that again, because I've seen it before, I loved it. I want to see it for a second time, and I thought, you know what? Let's see a new movie instead. And this is fairly new. It's been out like a week or two. Um, and I thought I'd just go and see this, and, um... Yeah, it was it was pretty crazy. She, the actress, just plays this character so damn well. She just nails it, and that's the best part of the movie. The rest of the characters is just like they do a good job, but they're not like amazing characters. But her character makes the movie scary. It makes the movie what it is, and she is everything that's good about this movie, basically. Even though she's not good, but you know what I mean. Like the way she plays the character is just it's it's perfect. It's perfect. So. Yeah, yeah, I, I, it was, for a horror movie that's supposed to be scary and creepy, it did its job, it did its job. Um, to rate it though, I don't know, I'd probably give it a 7, because I don't think it was great, I just didn't like the, the ending, I, it's, not a, it's not that I didn't like it, it's just that I wanted more from the ending, you know, it just, it just ended, you know, I, I just, I wanted more, that's why I can't give it like an 8 or a 9, but... I'll give it a 7. I thought it was fine. I thought it was fine. This is your boy Davidoff. Please like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a good day and see ya.